The Corps Marshal of the Federal Road Safety Commission, Mr. Osita Chiroka, says the commission is investigating the car accident in Kogi State that claimed the life of the former president of the Academic Staff Union of Universities, Professor Festus Iyai. Mr. Chidoka, who confirmed that the accident is the third involving the Kogi State Governor's Convoy this year, added that the drivers in the Governor's Convoy are yet to take part in the training for them two years after the exercise commenced. The FRSC boss noted that the Road Safety Commission is considering a compulsory installation of speedometers on convoy vehicles to curb the menace they constitute on Nigerian roads. When we saw that the convoy drivers were becoming a problem for the country, we started a process of training convoy drivers. And many state governments, we worked with the governor's forum, and many state governments submitted their drivers to training. And after the training, we decided that we we're going to develop a category of licenses for convoy drivers, so that we are sure that the person is qualified to be a convoy driver. Um, interestingly, the Kogi State convoy have not been involved in this training. Um, I'm just been told by the sector commander that the governor have asked him to take all the convoy drivers in Kogi State to, for this training because Kogi State drivers were not involved in the training. Of the 700 convoy drivers we trained in the last two years, um, from that day to date, none of them have been involved in any road crash. The only crashes we have seen so far from convoys are from people that have not attended that training. Because there were vital things they were taught about how to move in a convoy. 